Hey guys, welcome back to another video. So, the Ridge Wallet, am I right? Either love them or hate them, you can't deny that the Ridge is one of the most controversial companies out there making wallets today. And I'm not really sure why that is. Maybe because they get so much attention and most people just don't understand the modern minimalist wallet. And I believe it's because this looks nothing like your grandpa's old traditional leather bifold wallet. And because of that, the Ridge gets a lot of attention. So to celebrate my almost three year anniversary doing reviews here on YouTube, I'm gonna go back to my very first wallet review, which is of course, the Ridge wallet. And look, I'm even wearing the same shirt I did when I did that first Ridge wallet review. So what exactly am I gonna do? Well, I'm just gonna rank my least favorite Ridge wallet to my favorite Ridge wallet in that order. And I'm not gonna rank every single one of them, just the versions that I have right here. All right, so that's enough talk. Let's start checking these out. All right, so let's start with my least favorite version of the Ridge Wallet, and that is the Aluminum Ridge Wallet. Now, before you guys say anything, don't get me wrong, it's not that I don't like it, it's just out of all of the Ridge Wallets that I have over here off screen that I own, this is just my least favorite. But even at my least favorite, I still really like the Gunmetal Gray Aluminum Ridge Wallet. And this was basically my very first wallet review on this channel, the Gunmetal Aluminum Ridge Wallet. And since there's no other variations of the Ridge Wallet, they're all this, what I call sandwich style versions like you see here, I'll basically just be ranking the different materials that they come in. Because they're all gonna have the same features, they're all gonna hold between one to 12 credit cards, all of them block RFID, all of them are backed by Ridge's lifetime warranty, and they all have replaceable elastic right there holding these two plates together as you can see right there. But it should be noted when I did my very first Ridge Wallet review, I paid about 72 bucks for it. And right now on the website, the exact same wallet is going for 85 bucks. So they did up the price slightly, which that was one of my biggest negatives about the wallet was the price. But since I've been doing wallet reviews on this channel for the last couple years, that's kind of a mid-range price for modern wallets these days. Yes, the Aluminum Ridge Wallet is available in many different colors, but I only have this one, so I'm gonna put this back and let's go to my next least favorite Ridge Wallet, and that is the Titanium Matte Black Ridge Wallet. So this was a very tough pick for me, as all of these picks are, only because I absolutely love the Titanium versions of the Ridge Wallet. So why did I pick this my second least favorite is because the black tends to get scratched very easy. And as you can see, this one looks pretty darn perfect. It's because I just don't carry this one. And just like the other titanium Ridge wallets available, it goes for about $105 on the website. So uh, I really like the titanium. I'm probably just not ever gonna carry this one. But I'm gonna put this right back. And since I have other titanium Ridge wallets, in my pile over here. That's partly the reason why I'm not gonna carry it because there's other versions, as you'll see, that don't scratch as easy. Such as my next pick right here, the Burnt Titanium Ridge Wallet. So I did do a review on this wallet and any reviews of Ridge Wallets that I've done in the past, I'll put links below in my description box if you guys wanna check this out. So this is what the Burnt Titanium Ridge Wallet looks like. I love this coloration right here. And I know I just said that most of the Titanium Ridge Wallets go for about $105, not this one. This goes for $125. And I really like this Titanium version. It doesn't scratch nearly as easy as the Black Titanium version. Plus the colors are just cool. Plus it matches my happy accident, my titanium tactile turn pen, my attempt at anodizing. And as you can see, I meant it to be this beautiful color blue down here, but because something went wrong in the anodizing process, I got these really cool colors that go all the way up and it just looks exactly like the burnt titanium Ridge wallet. You can see if I turn it upside down what I'm talking about right there. So whenever I carry the burnt titanium Ridge wallet, I always make sure to carry this tactile turn pen. I love it. All right, so let's put that bad boy away and on to the next favorite Ridge Wallet material, and it is the 3K Weave Carbon Fiber. So the 3K Weave Carbon Fiber goes for $125 currently on their website. And yes, I did do a review on this one as well. 
I'll have all those links below, as I already mentioned. But what more can I say about this? Just the classic looking 3K weave carbon fiber look. It looks great. The version that I have is with the money clip. I do like the money clip, but I think I'm starting to lean more towards the cash strap lately. Just because the cash strap has the elastic, you can stretch that out as much as you want, as opposed to the very limited nature of this aluminum money clip right here. And when I first received this 3K weave carbon fiber wallet, it was my favorite at the time, but I've accumulated some other wallets here that I like just slightly better than this model right here. One of them, and it should be no surprise to anybody, is the forged carbon fiber. When this one came out, it absolutely blew me away because it was the first wallet that I've seen with the shredded forged carbon fiber look as you can see right there. And it goes for the same price as the 3K weave at $125. So if I had a choice between carbon fiber models, I'd have to go with this one just because it's so unique. I just love the look of this forged carbon fiber. And I do own both models of forged carbon fiber, the one with the money clip and the version as you see right here with the cash strap. And I chose the version with the cash strap just because like I said, I'm starting to lean more towards cash straps than money clips. This wallet was my everyday carry for a long time until you know I started getting back more into leather wallets. But let's see what versions I picked over the forged carbon fiber. And yes, the laser etched Damascus Ridge wallet. Now I just recently reviewed this and this one, there's a lot of confusion about. This version right here is made of 304 stainless and it is laser engraved to give it that Damascus look. It actually has texture to it. But even though this is a little bit less expensive than the Forge Damascus Ridge wallet, it still isn't cheap at 175 bucks. But I just love the weight of this 304 stainless and I actually do like that little bit of texturing on it. it gives a little bit of grip. And on top of that, you also get additional screws here. All the Ridge wallets come with the screwdriver, but you also get the money clip right here and it comes with the cash strap and you even have replacement elastic right in this box. So that's a pretty nice touch by the Ridge. All right, so now we're down to my last three Ridge wallets and these are my absolute favorite picks of all the models available, at least all the models available that I own. I just put this together wrong and there we go. And my third favorite Ridge wallet is none other than the titanium stonewashed version. And you probably already figured out why I like this one so much because I've mentioned it twice already. I love the titanium wallets, but because it's stonewashed, you guys can see that any scratches you put on it just blends right in. So just like a stonewashed finished blade on your pocket knife, you can basically take that out, beat it, and it doesn't look any different because if I get in real close, check that out. It's absolutely gorgeous. And I love titanium as a material for wallets. Super strong, very lightweight, and this comes in at the lower end price of the titanium wallets at 105. And I forgot to mention all the titanium wallets that I've showed you are made of grade five titanium. All right, so my second favorite Ridge wallet is the forged Damascus Ridge wallet. So if I had to count, I'd say I've been asked about seven or eight times if I wanted to sell this and I've said no each time because I'm just not gonna sell it. It's discontinued and there's a couple reasons why they discontinued this version. And there's absolutely no texture on this. It is smooth as a mirror as you can see right there. And because this is an actual forged Damascus wallet, it has a lot of upkeep, and if you don't take care of it, it has the potential to rust on you. So the Ridge basically figured that it doesn't really represent their company very well, so they basically just discontinued it. And this isn't cheap. This is the most expensive wallet that they had in their lineup at 300 bucks. And no, I still don't have any plans to sell this. It's just such a unique wallet. I don't have anything else in my collection like this. So what wallet can possibly beat out the forged Damascus Ridge wallet? And that is the brand new Forged Ember Ridge Wallet. And this Forged Ember Ridge Wallet is also the newest wallet in their lineup. And as of right now, it looks like it's sold out on their website, but let's just check this out for a second. I mean, this thing is absolutely beautiful. They took the Forged Carbon Fiber Wallet that I'm a big fan of, and they added these little red specks to it. And you can probably see where the name came from because it looks like fire embers that are just burning from a fire down here and floating up right next to the wallet. 
It is gorgeous. Now, I'm not exactly sure what these little red specks are made of. They might be colored pieces of the forged carbon fiber, some of the shreds there. But regardless of what it is, it became my favorite Ridge wallet currently and one of my favorite wallets out right now. And this one is priced slightly higher than their forged carbon fiber wallet. Those are 125. This one goes for 140. But unfortunately right now, as I already said, it is sold out right now. So I have no idea when it will become available again. I'm just lucky I got my hands on one of them. And also you can see it does come with the additional screws, a black screwdriver right here. That's pretty cool. And then the money clip and the additional elastic right there and as you can see it already has the elastic cash strap around the back and since i shared a picture of this on my instagram page i received a lot of questions about it so hopefully getting a nice close-up will answer a lot of questions that you have about this wallet now they do have other materials available for the ridge wallet that i don't have one specifically is this 18 karat gold plated ridge wallet it's priced at 225 dollars i don't have that version but even if i did have it i'd probably rank it pretty low maybe right under the matte black titanium and right above the aluminum gunmetal only because I'm not a big gold color guy, I feel like it's a little gaudy. And then of course, all the different colors for the 6061 aluminum, but once again, I would put those right at the bottom with the very first gunmetal aluminum wallet. And then there's the topographic ridge wallet right here that looks pretty cool, but I don't think I need to add that to my collection here. So what do you guys think of my favorite versions of the ridge wallet? And if you had to choose your favorites, which one would it be? Remember, there are no right or wrong answers here. These are all subjective opinions. These are just my thoughts, and I'm sure you guys have your own, but I'm really curious to see what your thoughts are. So leave a comment below and let me know what your favorite materials are. All right, guys, that's pretty much it for this video. What do you guys think of my rankings of my favorite Ridge wallet? Yes, the Ridge is still one of my favorite companies out there making wallets. And even though I'm not sponsored by Ridge wallet, I still have a special code just for my subscribers. That code is crispy. Put that in at checkout and you receive 10% off your next order. And since I'm not sponsored, I don't see a dime if you use that code. It's just there to help you out. And once again, I'll put all my Ridge wallet reviews down below in my description box. But if you guys did enjoy this video, please give me that thumbs up. Please subscribe and go!